My name is Scott Bradley and I'm the President and CEO of United Prairie Bank. 2018 we came off the best year we've ever had and uh, 2019 is shaping up to be greater than that. We have a really genuinely great group of people all the way from the executive team to our operational support team to the bankers in our branches. And I think our biggest desire is never being satisfied with the status quo. We need to be better. We have a, an acronym that's called ACT. We hold people accountable to communicate and to trust. And we really focus on that a lot. Accountability to our clients and to the bank as far as our behaviors. Communication within our staff to each other and, and with clients. And, and trust, that we can trust each other and that the client can trust what we're teaching them and trying to help them with. My name is Terry Voss and I am a personal banker at United Prairie Bank in Waseca. My name is Carrie Steele and I am the retail manager at the New Ulm branch. My name is Grant Germscheid. I'm the investment representative here in Mankato and also work for Spicer. Right now I'm the market president for both the Wyndham and Mountain Lake locations. I am an insurance agent and I'm at the Jackson, Minnesota branch. We want to see communities flourish. That's, that's part of being a community bank, being there for people in order to foster community growth. Today, our loan portfolio probably is about 40 to 50 percent agricultural lending, and we do a lot of commercial lending. In addition to that, we have a real estate department that does secondary market real estate loans. We've got an insurance agency, and we have an investment division. We are very close to our clients, and we offer them different options that are going to help them succeed with their financial needs. Primarily, I work with the front line, working with customers, giving them the support that they need. My favorite part of my job is it's having them be comfortable with their investment portfolio. There's always continuous training, there's yearly training because there's different things that change over the course of time, different rules, different regulations. One of the things that we have worked towards really hard is keeping our technology fresh because our next generation of customers are going to demand electronic services. They're not tied to the desk. If they're not located in our area, they can conduct business as normal from their office. They can scan in checks, they can take pictures of checks, they can approve those payroll files. We reinvest in our communities quite heavily, not only through just the lending, but in-kind service, volunteer hours, whether it's a local FFA project or you know a big United Way push. We take pride in being able to help the community in many different ways through the local Lions Club, the Rotary Club, United Way, different organizations that we like to help. The holiday party that is the last Saturday in January, everybody looks forward to it. Everyone and their significant other spouse is invited to pick up the tab for mileage overnight meals. The committee puts together a wonderful evening of entertainment where you can get to know a lot of the other people from other branches. There's always opportunities to be able to grow within the organization. We want to see people that want to succeed and want to see others succeed. Ask as many questions as possible. I mean that's how you understand really what the company is about and what your responsibilities are going to be. Always try to do what you say you're going to do and improve and do it with a great attitude. The genuine willingness that I see on people's faces when they come to work, they really want to be here. The biggest thing is getting to know the client so we can understand how we can serve them.